Yo! What is popping all over the world today? What is going on? We are live on all kinds of platforms. I'm going to let y'all join in with me. We are going to get interactive as a motherfucker. It is going down. It is going down. Shout out if you're just now joining me. Man, Royal Rumble, Poor Man's Podcast in the motherfucking building right here. Uh, predictions. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, uh. Uh, I'm not good with this shit right there. The prediction show, motherfuckers. We smoking some. They don't want none. They don't want none. What's up, Shane Pierce? What's good with you, boy? If y'all can hear me, what's up, Jason? If y'all can hear me, if y'all let me know how my audio's doing. I really don't know how the audio's doing until um, someone lets me know. What's up, Christopher Mace? Christopher Mace, what's up, boy? What's good with everybody? Um. We're live over here on um, YouTube as well. Uh, we might, I might have to go ahead and end that shit because I don't want it to fuck up my shit going on over here. Uh, we'll see how that ends up uh, working out. Um, like I said, what's up, Danielle? If y'all are just now joining, man, let me know how I sound in the audio. I really don't know until the shit's going down. Um, basically, so if y'all could let your boy know, just kind of tell me how everything is sounding on the up and up. What's good, Jason? Holla at your boy. Um, yeah, I might have to go ahead and end the uh, end the YouTuber. Yeah, we might have to just go ahead and end the YouTube. Join in with your boy. Uh, if y'all are watching Royal Rumble tonight, it is going down. Um, Goddamn, make sure you are fucking there. We're going to go crispy-fied in the fried rice. Uh, Goddamn. Goddamn, yeah. Pack up. I'm about to be doing my predictions here in a minute. Shit's been going down in the universe. What's up, Quadrupa? I can't ever remember. I can't say your name. Quaptra? I can't. I can't say it right. Anyways, it's going to be going down tonight. WWE Network. NWO. For life. You know what I'm saying? Welcome to the Poor Man's Podcast. I said, I am your host, the poor man himself. Sir Joseph Devious T. The Don himself. Um, Yeah, man. It's going down tonight. If you're just now joining... I got my boy Sebastian. We gonna be smoking up in this motherfucker. Join me. Cleopatra! Cleopatra! God damn it. What up, Char Brown? Uh, yeah, let me know, man. How am I signing out there to everybody? Like I said, three minutes in. I want to make sure that everybody's here be real good. I don't want to sound like a fucking retard. On the shit, so like I said, let me know in the comments over here. No, wait, over here. Let me know how I'm sounding over there. Tell me how I if I'm coming in crispy, if I'm coming in shitty. I need to know these things. I'm about to share this over to my wrestling group. Um, AJ Styles, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, boy. Yes, boy. Let me hear some of y'all predictions, man. Um, who y'all got for the Royal Rumble tonight? I'm going to go through mine. Hit me in the comments right now. Let me hear who y'all got. Um, I know uh, I know it's going to be going down tonight in a big way. A lot of people got pulling different ways. Braun Strowman's a big pick. Um, good. I'm loving the connection. And I'm loving it. What's up, Larry Coy? Holler at your boy. I'm just sharing this in my wrestling group. Then we're going to dive down deep into this shit. And of course, the second you try to do this with your phone, it starts acting retarded as a motherfucker as well. They don't want none. It's exactly right. God damn it. My bad for the dead air. I'm trying to post this over to my other group real quick here. Motherfuckers, uh... Yeah, goddamn, my phone slow as a bitch. That's all I got for it. Fuck them all in the dick area, mainly the dick hole. But you know how it goes. Y'all know how it goes. We got a whole list of shit going on tonight. Real Rumble kickoff starts at seven o'clock. 
motherfucking, uh, like, 4 p.m. Pacific. I don't know anybody in California, really. The Royal Rumble kickoff show. We got motherfucking Anderson and Gallows. They're kicking it off against the Revival. I know, uh, I know the Revival is a hot, up-and-coming motherfucking group of motherfuckos. I do wonder what the surprise entrances are going to be. That is a good motherfucking question. I'm trying to get to my goddamn live audio so I can keep up with the questions. Because it doesn't keep up with the questions like it should. So I'm just going to get hop over to my shit here. And just hop on the questions myself. It can eat a dick. Yeah, EC3 is supposed to be at... Uh, if y'all haven't heard, Ethan Carter the third is going to be... Or was that TakeOver last night? I haven't got to watch it, man. If y'all got to watch TakeOver... Don't spoil nothing for me. What's up, Nicole? Holla at your boy. Thank you for joining. What's up, Mike Bobo? Holla at your boy, Mike. A lot of shit went down last night in NXT uh, Philadelphia. If y'all don't know, Philadelphia is like one of the mainstays for uh, all things wrestling. That's the home of ECW Extreme Championship Wrestling. Home of uh, some, really, uh, some really memorable moments. In wrestling's history, uh, Shane Douglas tossed out the original East, you know, Eastern Championship title right there on the fucking spot. Told him to suck his dick. He's going on to bigger and better things. Let's let's jump into the prediction show. It's going down. Uh, Anderson and Gallows versus The Revival. The Revival is probably one of the greatest fucking new tag teams to come out in a long, long time. And I mean this... I mean this fully with no fucking, with no joking behind it. Um, see, that's why I hate fucking touchscreens because they're fucking bitches. Uh, I mean this fully with no jokes behind it. Whoa, let me turn your ass the fuck down. Anyways. Good, lo good lord. Fuck technology. Technology can suck a dick. Anyways. So, I got my money on the Revival. Hit me with what you guys got, man. I'm going with the Revival on this one. Put my money on it tonight. We got the Revival. I'm putting them down for my winner for the kickoff. Then going to be moving up the ranks. They're going to be your future Raw Tag Team Champions. Tag Team Champions. And you know what? To be completely honest, the way WWE goes, they'll probably split them up in about a year or two and make them be singles competitors, which I fucking hate. But, you know, to each their own. We got another pick for the revival. If y'all are smoking, man, light up with me, man. We this is a smoking session as well. We do get we do uses the marijuanas in this bitch. What's up, Des? What's up, Destin Leatherwood? Good seeing you, brother. Holla at your boy, man. Um, we gonna move on. Uh, next up, we got Mr. Bobby Roode. Sir Bobbeth Roode is going to be defending his United States Championship against an unnamed opponent. I predict. That that unnamed opponent is, of course, going to be Mr. Dolph Ziggler. I don't think anybody has to have um, keep up much to figure that one out because the dude has been going off uh, programming for a hot minute. I'm just going to tilt this down a little bit. Thank you very much. He's been off programming for a hot minute. People have been wondering what's going on with the whole uh, situation with him and the U.S. title. Yeah, you're going to go with the glorious one. I actually, I'm going to go with Dolph, man. I'm going with Dolph Ziggler. Dolph needs the win. He needs the win to make himself a legitimate... Um, believable opponent in upcoming pay-per-views and, and matches and shit on on SmackDown because the dude's losing steam. Flat the fuck out, you know what I mean? He ain't got the fucking, uh, he ain't got the juice that he used to have back in 2013, 2014. Um, I just don't think he's got it. If he don't win this, he's, he's, he's fucking donezos. So I'm giving it to fucking Dolph Ziggler. He's premiering the new U.S. title tonight. New design. I'm calling it now. Him and Rude will feud into WrestleMania. Rude will probably win his belt then. Back then, that's a whole another situation. We'll get to the we'll get to WrestleMania when that gets here. But my prediction tonight: U.S. title match. Bobby Rude loses to Dolph Ziggler. Cash it in right now. Dolph Ziggler loses, wins the U.S. title, officially retains because he never lost, technically speaking. There you go. Holla at your boy, Leanne Colgrove. Holla. Good seeing you. Chuck Hogan 
I wish I had the ropes like Ultimate Warrior and shake the fuck out of him. Fast Lane, for those that don't know, we'll be right here in Columbus, Ohio. I have not bought my tickets yet. I probably fucking should. I know my wrestling group and Yep will be mad at me if they find out that I did not go to WrestleMania or to the fucking Fast Lane the month before WrestleMania. So, um, from the kickoff show, two great matches for the kickoff show. People get all shitty, like, ah, oh, these guys should be on I man. You gotta have a reason to tune into the network just a little bit early. The kickoff show is not that bad. I think a new design is gonna happen. I really do. Our tickets on sale now. Tickets are on sale now for Fast Lane. And while we're talking about tickets and all that, make sure that you're here March 10th. Sess Crew. Motherfucker G Most. Or get lost in this bitch. So, like I said, March 10th for that one. Moving on. We're going to the fucking opening match for Royal Rumble. WrestleMania 36 will be in Detroit. Holla at your boy, Ivory. Good seeing you. So, we got the SmackDown World Tag Team Championship match. A best. Two out of three falls. Between the Usos. The Uso Penitentiary. Uso? I don't fuck with him like that. <coughs> I'm gonna skip past this. I don't like that song. It makes me feel funny on the inside. They are gonna be defending... <coughs> excuse me, against Benjamin and Gable. If y'all have not kept up with motherfucking... Who gives a fuck about Sasha Banks? We don't care, Sasha. Anywho, if y'all have not been keeping up, Benjamin and Gable have been on a lightweight tear through the division. They've been, uh, had a little subtle heel turn. Um, it was pretty dope, I'll admit. The heel turn was pretty sick, nasty. Who do y'all got? Let me see in, your, in the comments over here. Let's get some interaction going on. Who do y'all got for the World Tag Team titles in SmackDown? The Usos. Or Benjamin and Gable. I want to see what y'all got before I make my comment. He did get that DUI. But sometimes they give love, man. Sometimes they give love. Let me see a few more comments, man. Holler at the comments section over here to the side, man. Uh, holler over there, right there. Bam, bam. Uh, holler at me. Let me know where y'all are at with it. I got to know... Um, I gotta see some predictions here, man. I wanna know which... I already got my pick. It's all... All my picks are written down. Y'all ain't gonna get to see it all like that, though, because that's just not what you get to do. What's up, Chris? Man, uh, holla at your boy if you're just now joining. Um, so like I said, yeah, the Raw Tag Team... I know that's SmackDown. We're on, we're on that one yet. So, actually, the Uso fucking team just now kicked in this bitch. Um... Alright, so I guess uh, I guess Matt's the only one that's going to be joining me on these predictions. So, I'm going to hit y'all with my, my prediction. Benjamin and Gable, they're going to pull it out. Sorry, man. I got to turn this up a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. So, with that being said, Usos do not pull out tonight. They lose. Heartbreaking match. I predict it's going to be one of the matches of the night, though. I really think it's funny that they broke up Benjamin and Gable just to basically have them in the tag team, tag teams in the, uh, in the, in the Raw. I just think that's real funny. He called me crazy. I just thought it was real weird they did that. Then again, I'm not in the wrestling business. Um, I don't really, uh, you know, I'm not like in the dirt sheets and I don't keep up with the shit like that. Basically, I'm just a fan I like to watch the storylines progress. I hate the internet, even though I'm using it right now. The internet makes shit so fucking gay. Excuse my language, PC culture and whatnot, but it does, man. Motherfuckers be spoiling shit before it's even time. Dershey's be coming out. I don't give a fuck that. I mean, I do care in a way that Roman Reigns is going to be the goddamn champ going coming in after WrestleMania. I just don't care. Yeah, Jordan Gable. Whatever. You know what the fuck I mean? Smoking weed gets you fucked up, son. Anywho. Um, if you're just now joining, man, make sure you fuck with me on the Poor Man's Podcast. Like me on, like me on Facebook, wherever the fuck. If you, uh, join me on uh, YouTube. It's going down right now. Um, so yeah, my picks for the SmackDown World Tag Team Championship is going to be Benjamin and Gable. They pull out the victory. Mark it down now. 
That's how that's going to go out. They're going to get the best of the two or three falls. Uh, we're going to go ahead and move on to Rollins and motherfucking Jordan versus The Bar for the Raw World Tag Team titles. I think that uh, that it is going to be a, a very good match. I think I don't think it's going to be better than the the, mat, the tag team title match before it. I think they're going to have a lot of uh, they're going to have a lot to come behind. Basically, they are. They're going to have a lot to come behind. It's going to be a good match. Um, let me see what y'all got on your predictions, man. Hit me over here to the side. Let me know what y'all got. Hit me in the comments right quick. Let's see what y'all got. If y'all ain't smoking, fired up. Me and my boy Sebastian here. We're smoking on some motherfucking perp. Some of that Gorilla Glue. That purple Gorilla Glue. Shit's funky monkey, buddy. So, let me see. Like I said, hit me with your fucking comments over here. I gotta see who y'all got. Come on now. Don't be scared. It's just a wrestling prediction show. It's not like I'm gonna come take your money. Yo, money, money, money. Yo, money, money, money. So, yeah. Hit me with who y'all got. I'd like to see it. I know my pick, like I said. Um, I got the bar. Bar is going to come out the victory on this one, man. They're going to pull out the big W for the uh, for the Raw World Tag Team titles. That's just who I got, man. I feel, I, I feel like they're setting up a, a, a feud between Rollins and uh, Jordan. Uh, maybe uh, what's-his-name might make his uh, return tonight. I don't think that Dean Ambrose is really going to be out for eight, nine months like they said. I think it's storyline. I don't know. I think he might make his return. Uh, we'll see what happens with that situation. Like I said, my prediction, my prediction. Disagree with me if you want. I, I would love to have some disagreements. You know what I mean? But I haven't really had. No one's really said too much other than my boy Regal over here. Unless the comments just ain't coming in. But like I said, hit, hit him with the comments. Like I said, if you disagree, fuck you. You can suck a big old phantom dick. Um, but the bar's been hot, man. Uh, when, when Mick Foley people put them, when Mick put them together... As a tag team, really, people, everybody thought that they were going to just, they were going to just split up after a while. They weren't going to be shit, um, and they have proved everybody wrong. They've been a form, they've helped create a really good tag team division. It'd be good if they had more competition, like with the Shield, with the Revival. I would have loved to see Anderson and Gallows become more of a, um, you know, more prevalent in the division. Hopefully, maybe they're setting up something with the Revival on them. We'll see what happens. It'd be good to see them pick up some wins. But the bar's been the shit. I fucks with the bar. I love the bar. We are we uh we don't set the bar. We are the bar. You know what I'm saying? And then your boy right there, they they touch fists together like that. We gonna move on. We are gonna move on. Next up is going to be the the AJ Styles versus Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn for the WCW World Heavyweight Chip. I mean, wait, hold up. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought I was in WCW for some reason. AJ Styles versus KO and Sami Zayn for the WWE World Title. The dumbest fucking match, I think, in Royal Rumble history. I think it's stupid. I think that they people shit on WCW for doing literally the exact same fucking thing. And it's going to be honest with you, man. I think it is, it's just stupid. If WCW gets shit on for David Arquette being world champion... They should totally be shitting on the WWE for setting up a handicap match. This is the shit WCW did. Triple threat matches and shit, or uh, three-on-one matches for the hardcore title with Tank Abbott. Or whoever the fuck it was. I, I don't really remember. I think it was Brian Obbs. My, my WCW knowledge is a little rusty. I was a WCW fan. Don't judge me. It's it difficult times to my childhood. Anyways. Um... I think uh, I think that AJ Styles is going to pull out the victory tonight. Uh, I think Sami Zayn and KO are about to go into a feud. Uh, I think uh, AJ is going to pull out the victory. That's just what I think. Uh, something's going to happen. Uh, it's not going to be the way everybody thinks it's probably going to be. I know a lot of people are thinking that it's two on one, so KO and, and AJ or KO and fucking Sami are probably uh, going to pull out the victory. That ain't the way I see it. Um, I don't. So. You have that going for you. Uh, I think, uh, like I said, there's the setup for a feud of some type between uh, KO and Sami Zayn. AJ's going to pull it out. Some flute shit. One, two, three. 
Uh, I love AJ Styles since he's came into WWE. He's been a fucking, as they say, and rightfully so, he's been phenomenal. Super phenomenal. Uh, the man has put on five-star matches. We're not, if not five-star, pretty damn close to um, since entering the fucking company. He's carried Roman Reigns in their matches. Uh, John, He made John Cena raise up his fucking game. Um, every match has been great. It's the only matches I didn't really like, I mean, was against like, uh, Jinder Mahal. I mean, Jinder just is, is, you know, you don't expect much from him. He was great heel. His character was on point. He made you hate the motherfucker. He did a great job. People shouldn't shit on him as, as hard as they did. I think he did a great job as, um, as a heel WWE champion. Drew McIntyre, I don't like your new theme. It can suck a dick and die. Pete Dunn. I don't know what the fuck is going on here right now. I guess I'll just pick my own damn background music. Um. Yeah, so. Gonna uh, go ahead and move on from there, man. Uh, to the uh, Brock Universal Championship match. Triple threat. I want to hear who y'all got on this. We got Brock Lesnar. The monster among men, Braun Strowman. The Big Red Machine. Kane. Who do y'all got? Who are you pulling for today? Who is going to be the one y'all see pulling it out? Too Sweet Baby. Ray Morgan. Oh, too Sweet You. Hey, wait, wait. Too Sweet Your Boy. Co-champions are dumb. Lay Cool was the... They'd see, I didn't know that. I didn't know about Lay Cool ever winning... Uh, the whatever championship that was they won. I'm assuming that was a women's championship. I don't know. I don't know who Lake Cool was. That was probably a little before I came back and been watching. I took a little break there because Triple H is a bitch. And all he did was win fucking matches and beat Goldberg on Elimination Chip. <gasps> Fuck Triple H! Fuck you, Triple H! You can suck a fat fucking dick and die! I fucking hate you! But you did create NXT and that's pretty dope. I can't hang on that. But you can still suck a dick and die. I hope you fucking fall down on fucking Vince's cock face first. And you choke like... Ugh! And then you fucking just pass out. You fucking cotton goblin gutter whore. I fucking hate you. And I hope they sell the company just to spite you. What's up, Joe? Anyways. Back to the topic at hand. Brock Strowman. And motherfucking Kane. It's Kane! Undertaker! It's your brother! It's Kane! I miss those days, man. I miss I miss those old days, boy. My dog's got Braun Strowman. What's up, Bubba? Holla at your boy, man. Uh, I fucking hate Triple H. Anyways. Um, yeah, by the way, if you're loving this shit, if you're, if you're liking this shit, share it. Tell your people to join in. Be like, hey, man, my boy is killing it on some old shit. Come join us on some predictions. We're almost done anyways. We're on the home stretch right now. My personal pick for the night is going to be Brock Lesnar. I think he retains the WWE Championship going into WrestleMania. They put all their eggs in their basket for their boy. That man ain't going to drop the championship. That's uh, Vince McMahon's favorite boy right there. You know what I'm saying? He's told him, like, boy, you're the attraction. You're like, you're like what Andre was. People come out to see you now. R.I.P. Paul Bear. God damn right. It's your brother. It's Kane. Um. Yeah, man. Uh, shit. What was I saying? I done forgot. All right. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Brock Lesnar is gonna pull this one out tonight. He retains the uh, WWW, WWE Universal Heavyweight Championship. He will go on to WrestleMania to headline more than likely. Because Raw is still the A show, SmackDown still the B show. The day they have the WWE title come back, unless they have the Universal title somehow get traded over to SmackDown, which would be pretty interesting if they do that. Um, but it looks like they've pretty much kept, they're going to keep Universal on the, uh, the Raw brand and the World title on the SmackDown brand, which is not a bad idea. Keep it that way. Let's rock with it. Um, so, yeah, there's my prediction for the triple threat match. Brock Lesnar comes out on top. Um, if you disagree, Fucking hit me with the comments over here to the side. Fucking, I'll disagree with you until you could probably suck a dick. But that's okay. Braun, I mean, Braun is over. He don't need to be put over. That motherfucker's over. He flipped the fucking semi truck, motherfucker. Did you see that shit? He flipped the semi. The fucking semi. A semi. God damn. Jesus Christ.
Bang! Uh, alright, so, let's move on to the first ever WWE Women's Royal Rumble match. So many women are going to fuck up tonight and blow their spots. I just want to say this now. I, I Until here recently with Alexa Bliss, because that's my bitch Columbus represent, baby, you know. Um, I was not a fan of the women's anything. The women's revolutions kind of turned me back onto it. Charlotte Flair is my bitch as well. She's great. She takes her daddy's role and runs with it. Fuck it if she is running with her fucking family name. She does it in a great way. I love it. Don't hate. If you're, uh... Yeah. Uh, if you're hating, suck a dick. I don't care. Charlotte's the truth. Charlotte Flair is the motherfucking truth. I don't give a fuck what nobody says. That's just what it is. That's how we roll. That's how we roll! That's how we roll! Anywho. Um... Let me see who y'all got. Surprise entrances. Let's hear them for the women. I mean, I think we already know who's going to be coming out. You got your leaders. You got your Trish Stratuses. You got your Ivories. You got your Tories. You got your all these bitches are going to come out. Probably, if they have Tory Wilson come out, they better have Stacey Keebler come out. And if, if Sta Stephanie McMahon is already out there fucking, uh, is already out there doing whatever the fuck that she does, uh, she's going to be commentating, um, What's up, what's up, Bonner? What's good with you? Uh, she's going to be commentating, doing her thing. I'm not going to be caring about that. A lot of people made a big deal about it. I could give a shit less either way. I'm just looking forward to seeing all the blown spots. Uh, but yeah, let me hear, hear y'all on the... Um, what's going on with this? As long as Ellsworth doesn't come out. He might he might come out in the women's... Uh, my dog Christopher Evans would not like that tonight if he seen that. He would probably want to go in his surprise interest and drop kick Ellsworth clean in his... Motherfucking face. And whoever gave me a sad face on my goddamn like there, you could suck fucking cocks. The fattest of cocks. Yeah. I don't like you right now. My surprise interest is I've already said them. Uh, I could give a fuck less about them. Uh, I am putting Asuka over though. Asuka will win the women's uh, rumble tonight because she is one of the only legit females on the motherfucking roster. Uh, she, I think, is going to kick some bitches' heads off. Uh, I want to see her legit make some contact with a few females on the roster. Uh, scissoring and whatnot. I mean, wait, what? Scissor dropkick? Whatever. Puppies! Alexa Bliss is from Buckeye City. Uh, what was I about to say? Alright, moving on. Oscar, like I said, she's going to win the first ever Women's Royal Rumble. I'm putting her over, man. She's going to go to WrestleMania. She's probably going to face Bliss. She's probably going to win the Women's Raw Championship there. But that's a whole nother show. We'll leave that for WrestleMania season. That'll be then. This is the now. The now. Hashtag poor man's podcast. Hashtag PMP. Go like me on motherfucking Facebook. It's over here and shit. That, 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 that. I don't know how to fucking I don't know how to point. I don't know how this shit works. I'm backwards. I'm new. Over there, there's your directions. Poor man's podcast. I'm also on YouTube streaming right now. I probably have zero people watching me on that because I'm so fucking brand new to that shit. But check me out. It's going down one way or another. We're at the home run right now. Grand finale. The men's Royal Rumble. I don't know who the Royal. I don't know who's surprise entrances are gonna be. They seem like they got a pretty stacked deck as far as the rosters go. They'll probably have some NXT um, motherfuckers come in, uh, make an appearance. We'll see what happens. It'll be pretty uh, damn interesting um, to see who the uh, surprise entrances are. I'd like to really see who y'all got, though. Real talk. Hit me over here in the comments, man. What's up, Debbie? Good seeing you, girl. Um, let me see who y'all got, man, as far as uh, the surprise entrances go. I would really I would really like to see um, what, what your thoughts are. Um, who y'all got to win tonight? Uh, that, nah, we ain't, we don't do the game in this house. Nah, 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 uh-uh. Evolution or whatever the fuck this is? Nah, hell nah. I don't give a fuck what Evolution is. I fuck Triple H. That's how much I hate the man. I know his goddamn music so I can ignore it. Even though I like the other motherfuckers that was in Evolution. I don't fuck with him. He can fucking fuck Triple H. Anyways. Bring back Batista and Ryback. Bring back Goldberg. 
I want Goldberg versus Ryback. That's what I personally want. I, we'll get to my prediction here in a minute. I personally want Ryback versus Goldberg, the Battle of the Baldies. I want it. I want it, and you want it too. Don't lie to yourself. It's going to be going down. Personally, I also would like to see WrestleMania here in Columbus at the shoe. I think that would be the greatest fucking thing to happen. Mainly because I wouldn't need to go out of state to go do anything or get a fucking hotel. I could possibly walk down to that bitch. And back. Drunk as piss, too. That, I'm pretty close. Well, now nah, I'd have to drive my car down to that park. Stone Cold would be dope. Oh, my God. Yes. The glass break. Oh, oh, oh the glass break. Oh, I gotta, I gotta look it up. Just, god damn it. Stone cold. Stone cold. Stone cold. God damn it. Yes, yes. I want the glass break. I want to see him come out and stunner everybody and then throw himself over the top rope. That's what I want. Yes. Yes. That is what I want. I want the glass break. Hang on. That's what I want right here. Yeah. Everybody freaks out. They all start geeking. Everybody gets up on the seat. Oh, my God. Stone Cold. And then fucking Jim Ross comes out of nowhere with commentary. They didn't even have him on there, but he's out there. Stone Cold. Stone Cold. Black Gold. He's come out of nowhere to save the WWE again. He's here. I can't believe it. He's here. He, he's a, My God. He just stunned Kane. Kane just took the first stunner. By God. It'll be going down, bro. I'm telling you. It, 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 motherfuckers will be tripping out, and then the rock steam will hit out of nowhere. People will be like, holy shit, what the fuck just happened? The rock's here, too? They'll be like, the rock, the rock's here. And then it's Stone Cold. Like, I don't give a fuck. I'm about to drink beer. Give me beer, motherfucker. And then, uh, yeah, it's, it'll be, it, I, oh, man, yeah. And then... And then peep game. Peep game. Peep game on this. Then everything goes dark, and you hear this. You hear this, right? Everybody geeks out. Oh my god! Chills up your fucking spine, right? Chills up your spine. It's gonna be a slobber knocker! It's gonna be a slobber knocker, boys! That'd be me personally. I would love to see Undertaker come back, do some Royal Rumble shit, exit himself as well. I got excited. I'm sorry. I got really excited, and I need to calm down. There's children watching. There's children watching. But god damn it, there's there's human fish frogs. God damn it. Mankind would be the most dope entrance, and I mean mankind, mankind with the the leather strap face and all that. I don't mean the bullshit with fucking like you know Mick Foley or Cactus Sack or Jack or Dude Hove. None of that. I want mankind, mankind. That's the shit I want right there. I want that. Give me that. All right, ladies and gentlemen, my prediction for the winner of tonight. I got way off topic. And I'm going to tell you all my prediction for tonight's Royal Rumble winner. My Royal Rumble winner is... I'm going to actually... Hang on. I'm going to... I'm going to... I'm going to do it by music. That's right. I'm going to do this by music. So, hit me with your thoughts right now. Who do y'all got for the winner of the Royal Rumble? Hit me with your comments right now because I'm about to hit you with mine. This is going to be the winner. No doubt. I guarantee it. I've got guarantees that my win my pick for the Men's Royal Rumble will be the winner. He will go on to headline WrestleMania against Brock Lesnar for the WWE Universal Championship. It's going down. Hit me with your thoughts right now. Hit me with them right now. Hit me with them. Hit me with them now. Because here's my thought right here. Everybody, get ready. Your winner for tonight's Royal Rumble is... Amazing. Uh, not a commercial. Here's your winner for tonight's Royal Rumble.
believe that. Ladies and gentlemen, you either get with it or you get lost. Roman Reigns will win tonight's Royal Rumble whether you fucking like that shit or not. Holla at your boy, Dylan. I just seen your shit come in. That's right. Roman Reigns wins it all tonight, y'all. Get with it or get down. That's all I got to say, man. I don't like it. I want Nakamura to win. If you want who I want to win, motherfucking Nakamura. Hands down. That's. I don't want Roman Reigns, but the man is the face of the company. He is the winner of tonight's Royal Rumble. 2018, he will go in on the road to WrestleMania to face Sir Brock Lesnar for the Universal Championship. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Trust me. Holla at your boy, Bubby. Bubby Galloway just joined. Bobby Nails. Holla at your boy, Bobby Nails. Holla at your boy. Good seeing you too, my brother. What's up, Joe Dials? What's up, Trinity Moore? Y'all just joined the end, unfortunately. If y'all would like to go back and watch this shit, this shit will be on... YouTube, um, follow, uh, subscribe to me on YouTube, by the way, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, share my shit on there, share this post, like me on motherfucking, uh, Poor Man's Podcast, if you just missed it, I will go over my predictions one more time with y'all, Anderson Gallows versus The Revival, Revival goes over, Bobby Roode versus the to be announced opponent, who I think is Dolph Ziggler, Dolph Ziggler, he goes over tonight, SmackDown World Tag Team Championship match. Usos versus motherfucking Gable and Benjamin. Benjamin and Big Gable go over. They win the new division. Raw World Tag Team Championships. Rollins and motherfucking Jordan versus Shield or fucking Shield. Sorry, versus the Bar. Bar going over tonight, y'all. Bar get the victory. AJ Styles versus KO and Sami Zayn. Handicap match. AJ Styles going over for the WWE world title. He will win it. He is retaining. Brock Lesnar versus Braun versus Kane. Triple threat match. Universal championship. Brock wins it. I would love to see Braun win it all, but he ain't, baby. Brock gonna take it all to the take it all to the fucking take it all to the house. Women's Royal Rumble tonight. Oscar is going to take it to the house. Oscar going to take it to the house. That's going to be the big victory for her. She's going to be the first ever woman, first ever woman to win the women's Royal Rumble. And last but not least, like I said, like I said, you either get with it or you get lost, baby. Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns is going to win the WWE men's Royal Rumble and go on the headline. WrestleMania against Sir Brockett Lesnar. Guys, thank you for tuning in. Thank you for joining me. I'm going to fade to black at this point. But thank you all very much. If you fuck with me, I didn't broadcast on Poor Man's Podcast tonight. Like that shit. Please like the pod, Poor Man's Podcast over here to the side. Fuck, fuck pointing, right? Right? God damn it. Like that shit. Go to my page. Please like that shit. If you're on YouTube, go to my YouTube. Like that shit. Share this post. It will be going up. It will be available once this broadcast is over. I thank you all. Thank you very much. Join me. We will be doing a post-Royal Rumble. I might have a reaction thing to the thing. I don't know. I've never really done that. I don't want to get in trouble. I've gotten in trouble multiple times now for broadcasting WWE content. I don't want to get in trouble and lose my shit. So, um, might do a reaction video. Um, if you're a friend of mine local here in town, feel free we have, I have the network. Come over, watch this shit with me. We'll be smoking out. We will be chilling. We will be fucking enjoying ourselves. Um, like I said, join me tonight. Post Royal, Royal Rumble show. Uh, we will be talking about some shit. Fuck their talk show after thing. Nobody likes that shit. You want to join DVST? I'm your guy. I'm wearing an NWO shirt. We're too sweet and out in this bitch. Stay with me. We out. Peace. Oh, yeah. Uh, YouTube, we out. Peace. We out of this bitch. Thank you for tuning in.